Leo, you're not allowed on the balcony until further notice. Somebody thought it would be a good design to put a hole in the fence, just Leo sized. So yesterday he decided to go on an adventure to the neighbor's deck. I have no idea what he did over there. I know is there's a chewy that doesn't belong to you on the floor downstairs. Do you know anything about that? Happy good morning, quick update. Bed's on the floor. Hopefully that'll change next week. Legging 2.0 shelves are in process. Legging shelf 2.0. Hey, good news. Hey, good news. All right. Just two more to go. Three more to go. What? One of the pieces was broken, but hopefully that will be fixed next week as well. Oh, by the way, Tyler got this for me for Christmas. He got it from a guy that like salvages old Louis Vuitton bags and sews these little bears and then adds Swarovski crystals. Thanks, babe. Late. I'm going to the gym. I'll be right back though. Well, let's try the new 3D flavor. Are the lights doing that? Is that always gonna happen? This camera's totally busted. Turns out I did not understand the extent of the busted until this oh moment. Gosh. The whole back of the camera came off in my hands. Oh, almost ran a red light. Just kidding, it's green now. I literally have to hold the screen in place right now. So we zoomed as fast as we could to Foster's camera shop to see if they could save the day. Yeah, I have this camera and there's a lot wrong with it, but right now I just need a, a couple screws okay. to... Okay, my technician is not in right now. Oh no. So... Um, they couldn't help us, so we're gonna go to Allen's. If they can't help us, I don't know who will. <laughs> Get it, because our last name's Allen. All right, we just called Allen's. They don't have any screws. I was beginning to feel quite dismayed when it occurred to me, why don't we go to the place that can fix any problem? Well, let me just see if they actually fit in first. Yeah, they had a lot of screws, but everything they had was too big. But here's a fun fact that Tyler forgot about. His uncle in town owns a nut and bolt shop. If he can't help us, I'm buying a new camera. And you'll never guess what we found. Nothing, new camera it is. <laughs> We're also gonna go drop Lee off at the pet hotel. This place is insane. They have a pool, pool chairs, TVs. He's gonna love it. Ta-da! Wow, look at it. No scratches, probably not sand in it. The lens probably works. This is much needed, honestly. Oh yeah, this thing feels solid. Fun fact, our gym is in the middle of the mall. So it takes every ounce of self-control not to wanna go buy a new gym outfit every day. After some lunch and a taste test of the new 3D flavor, which for the life of us, we could not figure out, we called it Mystery Berry until 3D solved the mystery for us. <laughs> we finally made it to the gym. I reviewed this Lorna Jane outfit and a bunch more of their stuff in my last YouTube video, by the way. Oh, it's so good to have a camera that works. Speaking of expensive stuff that doesn't work, <laughs> I wanted to give you guys an update on my professional laser hair removal that I paid like $5,000 for. <laughs> Cause um, it didn't really work. It worked on my bikini area fairly well, which is the main area I was the most concerned about, but my legs and underarms, yeah, it all grew back. <laughs> so 10 out of 10, don't recommend spending that kind of money on that especially when there's at-home options for a fraction of the price. <laughs> so I decided to do a little experiment with the at-home one that I have. And I only lasered one armpit for like a month and a half and not the other. And literally there was such a noticeable difference. I could tell that my right armpit was reduced by like 50% more than the left. <laughs> so the little at-home guys definitely work as long as you're consistent with them. Listen, I wouldn't keep talking about this if I didn't believe in it. <laughs> Kenzie is an at-home premium IPL handset. It comes with the handset, the power cord, which is conveniently long. Long, and the user guide. It works best on dark hair and you can use it on your entire body, including your face and Brazilian. That's one of the main areas I've been using it on and I have seen amazing results so far. A little while back, I actually did an entire video on laser hair removal, comparing my professional laser hair removal experience to my initial couple months experience with this handset. You can go watch that if you want to. One of the best parts about this at home one too is it is very gentle. It doesn't hurt nearly as bad as going and getting it done, even on the highest level. Most people begin to notice results within the first month with complete results after 12 treatments. So you do one a week and then after that you can kind of spread them out as needed. Thank you Kenzie for sponsoring this video today. If you guys haven't had a chance to get your hands on one of these, they are running their best deal yet. You can use code HOPE50 for $50 off. You can get it for just $179. The link is down below at the top of the description box. New activewear, yeah. This is one of two of our Alpha Elite packages from the birthday sale. Tyler got hoodie, t-shirt, joggers, and I got a Barry Aspire top and this golden camo. Okay, I'm gonna get ready because we have a heck of a lot to do before we go out of town later. Okay, time to pack. You can pause the screen if you want any details. We're gonna be gone for a week, so I have a lot of stuff. Makeup bag, of course. 
hair dryer because once you get one like this, you can't use anything else. Curling iron, brush, and little travel size shampoo and conditioners. Okay, life hack. Go to Nordstrom skincare section and ask for samples. These little guys are perfect for travel and you can get incredible brands like this for free. Tanning mousse and this face tan I've been loving. It goes on nice and easy just like lotion and the color is beautiful. Active wear for reviews and workouts during the week, of course, and more stuff for review. I'm also bringing a few dressy outfits because we're going to a business conference in Vegas this weekend and then just some casual outfits, t-shirts, sweaters, sweats. I've been notorious for underpacking in the past, so I am not about to let that happen this time. Boom. Okay, this next thing that I'm about to show you is what I like to call my breakfast. Normally I have it way earlier on in the day, but today was a weird day with a weird start. So I have my pumpkin shake, mood pills for happiness, micronutrient pack, and the greens. These greens are something I've been implementing into my morning routine for a couple weeks now. There are so many amazing ingredients in this. I'm just gonna show you. And the benefits of this green drink, I, I don't even have time to mention them all. <laughs> but the main benefit that I've noticed from it, I get painfully bloated when I travel and also if I eat too much bread. And I have noticed that this stuff helps so much. Along with all of the vitamins and minerals, there is a plant enzyme blend and probiotic blend, which help break down your food, keep your digestive tract healthy, increase energy, and keep you regular. Good stuff. I'll link this and all the supplements that I take down below. Last thing I need to handle before we go, merch orders. So you may have heard via Instagram that I'm no longer doing merch. Shop Hope Scope will be no more, at least as it is. And it's not because like, merch was a failure. It was not a failure by any means. It was the opposite, in fact. <laughs> That's why I have to stop doing it. I am so grateful for the thousands of orders that have been placed the last couple years, but I have been doing all of it myself with the help of Tyler <laughs> and it's just getting to be too much. So I either need to hire somebody or just completely go a different route because at this point it's just taking too much time away from creating videos. That's where I'm at with it. But this is crazy, look. This is all that's left, two boxes. At one point there was like over 20 of those <laughs> full of stuff. So we're, we're down to the last of it. But this is why I can't do it anymore. <laughs> this is our guest room. Ugh. I did have the luxury there for a while of having an 800 square feet of office, uh, but that's no more. So another reason we gotta we gotta figure something else out. <laughs> and we're off. We made it to our cute little Airbnb in St. George. I actually have a couple videos planned for when I'm here. So I'm excited for you guys to see those. So I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye YouTube.